Hey guys, and welcome back to Music with Mr. Bartlett. Okay, so today we're going to get straight into it. We're going to do some African drumming. And uh, if you have one of these drums, you're very lucky. If you don't have a drum, uh, I've spoken to uh, you guys before about what to do. Um, so you could actually go and just get a bucket, or you could get a saucepan, or you could get a cushion, anything really that you can have a tap on on your desk on your lap, be resourceful and find something that you can use as a drum. So if you want to go and grab that now, we're going to get straight into it. Go for it. Welcome back to Music with Mr. Bartlett. Okay, so African drumming um, came from Africa. That's funny, isn't it? And um, we're going to talk about the drum circles that originated from African drumming. So drum circles, to my knowledge, started in America. And drum circles are like a uh, big community event uh, that uh, often people go to to um, you know meet and, and and enjoy each other's company and relax and have a good time and uh, all that kind of stuff. So it's a real community thing. We're going to have our own little community happening today. We can do one of a, a couple of things. Uh, you and I can play together, or you can go and grab some other people and bring them into the drum circle, and they can join in. So that would be pretty cool if you wanted to do that. Be my guest, okay? So go and grab them, but of, of course you'll all need to be, uh, to have something to play, and you'll all need to uh, be in a circle if you can. But you know what? You can have two people in a drum circle. You can have 20 people, you can have 200 people, so it doesn't matter uh, how small or large your drum circle is. Let's warm up our hands, let's go. We know how to do this. And we're gonna be talking about three rhythms today only. All right, so... If you're new to my channel, you might not know these rhythms, so I'll go through them, but a lot of you potentially wouldn't know them. The first rhythm is, okay, sorry, we'll might be drum first, <clears throat> and then we'll get stuck into our rhythms. Okay, the first rhythm is, and these are going to be really simple, guys, eat banana. one one banana and its skin so it's the same rhythm as eat banana and then we just add and its skin one banana 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 and its keep going The final rhythm is, I like bananas. And I'm going to see if you guys can actually play it without me doing it here. So I'll say it twice and then you guys play it. I like bananas. I like bananas. Excellent. They are our three rhythms today, guys. Let's do them one more time, four bars each. Eat banana. Ready, go. Actually, you know what? Let's go faster. Sorry. One, two, ready, go. And one banana and its skin. One, two, ready, go. Bananas, I like bananas. That's my favourite one, I like bananas, because it's a little bit trickier. If we do these rhythms, and uh, well, actually, the drum circle rhythm will be based around eat banana, and I'm going to encourage you guys to maybe. Uh, do one banana and its skin or I like bananas experiment while I'm playing okay have a have a little bit of a jam session with yourself improvise you know how to do it 
Okay, uh, so what we're going to do, let's talk really briefly about the drum circle. So obviously it's, you know, two or more people. Um, if you've got, you know, lots of people, you would be obviously in a circle and you can do th things like rumble. Rumble to a rhythm, okay, so we could do this, rumble with me. Uh, slower and then worked into a beat and then worked into a rhythm you could, uh, you do things like that there's a thing called orbit where you are uh, the facilitator who would be the leader of the drum circle would point to people and they do a rumble so you get this uh, building up of sounds going all the way around the drum circle and going back uh, again that's kind of hard to do in this environment but I'm just giving you a bit of information maybe you could get, get onto YouTube and have a look at some drum circles because they are unbelievable okay uh, and then we do call and response okay and we're gonna do that in the drum circle itself uh, when we do that today with each other so uh, we might be doing eat banana and I'll go okay call and response one two three four and then after four you guys stop I will call and you respond let's practice that And then we go back into the rhythm. Okay, so I usually do four four call and calls and responses. Okay, uh, so four back and forth. That's it. Um, I reckon that's it. Oh, a solo. You guys are going to do a solo. All right, so we'll be going along like this. And we'll do three solos. I'll assume that you're there with another two people, okay? So if you're not there with another two people, you're there with another person, then maybe you could go your solo, their solo, your solo, because we're gonna do it three times. If you're there with three people, you take a solo each. If you're there by yourself, you get three solos. So, we'll be doing this. counted four you heard that I went straight to a normal beat okay so a heartbeat that's underlying your solo and the solo might be this or a solo might be this keep it simple all right you could even do one of those three rhythms that we've spoken about today as your solo just keep on playing eat banana by yourself or keep on playing one banana or keep on playing i like bananas it's up to you i've done enough talking let's do the drum circle have you got your other people with you if not don't worry because we'll have some fun together let's go we're going to start with a rumble piano
Okay, guys, I hope you enjoyed music with Mr. Bartlett today. We're going to finish off with a crescendo. We're going to gradually get louder, building up to the end.